and one of Baltimore's biggest ambassadors returns home today. The Pride of Baltimore, too, has been on a four-month journey promoting tourism for Baltimore and around the Chesapeake Bay. The vessel even picked up a few new crew members, providing a once-in-a-lifetime experience. It's the return home. Uh, the ship took off May 13th to head down to Charleston to an international tall ship festival in Charleston. There was a regatta race going to Bermuda. For the past four months, the pride of Baltimore, too, has traveled nearly 3,000 miles, competing and entertaining thousands from Charleston, South Carolina, to Bermuda and back up to Boston. The ship's purpose is to promote the Baltimore area and all things associated with the Chesapeake Bay. She is the most known American sailing vessel sailing today. Maryland has had it, Baltimore's had it for decades, and it's a great messenger. It's a great ambassador. Once in Boston, six crew members joined the 10-person crew aboard the vessel for the seven-day sail back to Baltimore. Different from uh, any other kind of summer vacation I've ever done, that's for sure. We weren't obligated to help, but we were, uh, you know, we helped as much as we possibly could, but I got to tell you, it was a lot of work. The work those aboard didn't mind and said they would do again. It's kind of like the job of the Pride of Baltimore, too, makes you want more. You can get them hot, you can get them cold, you can get them wet, you can get them seasick, but they're never going to forget you. And the Pride of Baltimore, too, will be in its slip for the next four months. It's halftime to visit.